But look at this. This is a little shopping hole that was built recently on Rob Street. Reminds me of the uh, shopping coves you find in Antigua. Oh, this is my, this is my, this is my day. I'm ready to take it on, come what may. This is Rob Street. Right at the corner of Rob Street and Camp Street. And those are the buildings that are going up. For the Teleperformance Company. We saw those before. Teleperformance Company is one of the new industries in Guyana. Call center. And this is the Republic Branch. And that's Wall, uh, Rob Street looking west. So the question is, which is the most important street in Georgetown? And that question, the answer to that question depends on who you ask. This street, Rob Street, is one of the business streets, second only to Regent Street. So if you ask the businessman, which is the most important street in Georgetown, that street is probably Regent Street, but Rob Street would come a close second because Rob Street used to be the headquarters, probably still is the headquarters for the People's Progressive Party. Across the street there is the Guyana Police Consumers Co-op Society, that works where the police officers do their shopping. They have discounted prices, discounted prices. But look at this. This. Is a little shopping hole that was built recently on Rob Street. Reminds me of the shopping coves you find in Antigua. Right, so this is now on Rob Street. Here you have a telephone shop also one of the new industries here and new businesses here everybody sells these uh, cell phones and so Rob Street has been transformed recently into the second most important street in Georgetown because of all of the businesses that are going up in Rob Street there's always been a pretty busy street but what is interesting is that it's becoming revitalized because it's close to the city center and it's still a destination for shoppers right just one block away from Regent Street that's a curry Shop, a little takeout, takeout shop for fast food. This is the uh, Digicom. It's becoming a famous Wellington Street. And on Wellington Street, a competitor to Digicom, Gizmos and Gadgets. All right, so Rob Street is becoming. This is a new building went up, it's recently opened, American Home and Beauty Center. <laughs> it's becoming revitalized as one of the important shopping streets in Georgetown, with new businesses moving in recently. Famous Freedom House, headquarters of the PPP. And these are new shops, a little motorcycle store. 
and some Chinese dry goods stores. That's a sports clothing store. Fast food restaurant, Chinese fast food restaurant. Now the Chinese dry goods store. Red mango. Cards and gift shop. So there are all these little stores that have always existed, but recently have become uh, revitalized and this kind of reinvestment phase going on. So typically what has happened is when Guyanese businessmen want to uh, redevelop a location, they would start a fire and burn the place down, collect the insurance money, and then rebuild. And that is what is believed to have happened at this corner, this intersection. There used to be a large wooden building in this location, but about two years ago, there were speed there was a spate of fires and this building was one of the buildings that went up in flames and now you have shops going up there this is King Street St. George's Cathedral King Street Right, that's King Street. I'm saying there used to be a large wooden building at this intersection. And now, as you can see, after the fire, new construction. So, this is Rob Street. And I think it's fast becoming one of those contenders for most important streets in Georgetown. Here is Scotia Bank, Canadian bank. Used to be my bank. No longer longer bank with them because their fees are exorbitant. But the presence of a bank on Rob Street also lends to the importance of Rob Street. Here is the Demerara Mutual Fire and Life, Mutual Life Assurance Society, it's an insurance company, also on Rob Street. China Trading and Hong Tai Trading, these are new Chinese dry goods stores. And because if you go all the way to the end of this street, Rob Street, crosses over Avenue of Republic at this intersection. Right, Avenue of the Republic. And goes all the way to the river, the Demerara River, which you will find right at the end of Rob Street. You will find The wharfs. I think at the end of this particular street is John Fernand's Wharf, where you will find uh, shipping containers being offloaded. Fast food restaurant. It's an important area, important industry. Like I said, fast food restaurants are. one of the important new investment areas. But yeah, this is Rob Street and it's becoming one of the most important streets in Georgetown. As we head to the end of Rob Street, this is the post office. All right, this is the 
old post office building has been repainted recently. And this is another colonial style building. All right, another colonial style, one of the few colonial style buildings with the wrought iron uh, work. This one is the Diana Trinidad Mutual Life Insurance Company. And that used to be Fogarty's. Right, this used to be the Fogarty's building. Now owned by the Parkin. And here is your bank, another bank, another branch of Republic Bank. Alright, so this would be the main, one of the main branches of Republic Bank on Water Street compared to the one on Cam Street, which I use. And then here is GBTI, another bank, and a bank with trading, trading industry. So this is Water Street. Practically Flemish Board Limited. Top of the street is Diana Stores. Yeah. And if you look down this way, you'll see Sabbath Market Square. And this is Water Street. Market. So this is a extension, I think, of Sabbath Market. You can consider it to be that now. So like I said, Rob Street runs all the way into the river at this end. And at this end is where you receive your shipments, uh, international shipments coming in, because this is the wharf, John Fernand's wharf. So if you do international business and you ship items in, say, with the Parkin, they arrive here, all your barrels and your containers. I've actually done some of my shipping through this wharf. But that is it. This is Rob Street. And I think it's a contender for one of the most important streets in Georgetown. And all the way in the distance, the river. All right, you look across the river at the end of Rob Street, the Demerara River. So there you have it, one of the most important streets in Georgetown, Rob Street. Want to see more content like this? Click like and subscribe in the comments below. Tell me which you think is the most important street in Georgetown. And if you don't know Georgetown, tell me which you think is the most important street in the city where you live. Perhaps I'll take some time out to come and film it. Later!